Stacy and I'm Felicia and this is Pretty, Pretty Culture. Culture. Well today we're coming to you to talk about our piece. If you've been on Instagram or Facebook then you know what we're talking about. It's called A New Statement and we'll be performing it at the Houston Fringe Festival. Our dates are October the 2nd, 3rd, and 5th and this is a piece that we've been working on for a while. So some of you may be asking who is Sarah Bartman? Who is this person, this woman that we have been posting about on Facebook and on Instagram? So we just kind of wanted to give a brief synopsis, if you will, of like who she is, the history and everything, and why it's so significant to us. Well, Sarah Bartman, her real name, or I guess you could say her tribal name, her given name would be Sarchi, and she's a Khoisan woman from South Africa. She is a a very significant figure in South African history and South African the colonial era. She was born in 17, wait, 1789 and yeah, 1789 um, and the biggest thing is that her body was paraded around in Europe. Her, the British came, the land was dispossessed, the, her people were dispossessed because of ownership of land and things like that in like 1778 and because of her body she was taken to London and her body and its figure and its form, if you look at some of our pictures on Facebook and on Instagram, you can see. But it was it was paraded around, for lack of better words, and in a very sexual way. They took away her given name and called her um, the Hot and Top Venus. And this was a very sexual name. She did different shows. The best parallel I can give you is kind of like the circus type, mm -hmm. those freak shows, those earlier type freak shows. And she paraded around naked, or did different things, different acts. And it was very, very derogatory. And she gained a lot of fame, and it wasn't in a good way at all. And so that's just like a brief thing. And found this book at um, Half Price, learned about her, then found the book and read a little more. And Stacy can tell you, but we've been talking about it like for over a year now. Yeah, so we've been going back and forth throughout the years and we've decided that we wanted to create a piece that addresses some of the issues. So sometimes um, as black women, particularly young black women, we have these images put out about us, um, some negative, some we put out ourselves, and we wanted to see how we could make sense of all this. How does this relate to history? So when you think about Sarah Barman, you think of this woman whose body was on display at the museum for anyone to see and anyone to touch. And when you think of some of our contemporary pop culture, what do you see? Black women's bodies on display for everyone to touch, for everyone to get whatever entertainment value, recreational value out of it. And just to give more, bring more light to the human experience, like what does it mean for that to be the image that's put out on you, like how would you want to reimagine re that image? And so that's kind of where we brought the piece from. So if you think about Sarah Bartman, how does she still, a woman from a colonial times in South Africa, how does she relate to our society in 2013? And so that's exactly what our piece deals with. And that's what we'll be discussing or exploring through movement if you guys come to the show. And I do want to share that it was Nelson Mandela that brought up the issue of her body because in 1994, um, during his presidency, he brought up the issue of her body with the French president because they had her full body cast in the um, Museum of Natural History in Paris. And it wasn't until like 2002 they brought her back home to mm -hmm. South Africa. So I thought that that was really significant as well because she is now buried in South Africa. But Google it, look it up, look at our Instagram page. And come to the show. Look, <laughs> yes, like look at the Facebook page. We have different pictures and just learn about the history. And like I said, our piece will be paralleling that image for black women. So it is October 2nd at 8 p.m., October 3rd at 9.30, and October 5th at 6.30 p.m. And it's all at Barnavelda Movement Arts Complex, which is 2201 Preston. It's right in the center of Houston, across from where Minute Maid Park is. In the Dynamo Stadium. And the pre-sale tickets are only $10. So please come support. Thank you. Thank you.